Hi viewers, so welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to review a graphic tablet which is Tenmo T305. So in this video, I will unbox that device and then I will guide you where you can purchase the device. After that, we will install the softwares which are associated with this device and which will help you to configure that graphic tablet. And in the end, we will have a practical demonstration and we will use that device uh, in PowerPoint. So this is Tenmo's T503 graphic tablet. It comes in four colors, whereas I have a blue one. So now we will open this box and see what's inside. So there's a box within a box. So we will open that black box and see what we got in this graphic tablet. So there's a styrofoam protection. First of all, we will remove that one. We can see a USB cable, which is a micro USB cable, and you can use it to connect it with the laptop. This is a small document to guide you how to install the software and how to use that device. There is a glove which is available so that the impression of your hand cannot be transferred to the laptop. This, these are some connectors. This is a Type C connector which will be used to connect this device to your type c mobile phones this is a micro usb connector and this connector will be used to connect your device with a mobile which has that type of connector but this is the actual pen which we are going to use along with this board it has two buttons plus and minus and you will see what are the functions of these buttons there are some extra nits which are available with this device you can replace the old wear out uh, nib with new one whenever you want it's a very easy process and there's a tool available to do that task but this is the actual device that we will explore later on this is a tool which you can use to replace the old nick or tip with the new one so there is, there is a semicircular hole which can be used to remove the old tip but this is the device which we are going to use this is 10 moons T503. It has four reconfigurable buttons. You can use any keyboard shortcut. And this is the back side. And this is the micro USB connector. With the help of which it can be connected to your laptop, mobile phones, or any other device. You can purchase this graphic tablet from AliExpress. You just have to go to the AliExpress website and then type 10 moons t503 you will get a lot of links you just have to click on the most suitable link so this is the tablet which we are talking about in this video so it is available at the cost of 20 to 25 us dollars and these are the four colors which are available you can purchase it from three different origins so the software installation process is very easy you just have to connect this a graphic tablet with the laptop and then you have to go to your my computers then there will be a drive which will be available you just have to click on this setup tablet setup v4 and then install a simple software After the completion of this installation, a web link will be opened and you will ask to download another file. You just have to download this file. This is the actual software which you have to install. You just have to open the folder and then install the software. So that's it. So now we will close these windows and explore the actual softwares and see how to configure the device so now you have to go to the start menu and you will see these two softwares which are installed we will open the software this is the screen mapping option you can map the screen or the available space of the tablet with the screen of the top or any computer which you're using you can simply change the available space by using the handles the red color handles which are available on the blue boxes
so by doing so you can actually change the effective area of this graphic tablet and uh, you can map the graphic tablet screen with the, with the laptop screen you can also define the keys which are available at the top so these are the four keys and you can you can set any keyboard shortcut to these keys you just have to click the required key on the software and then select the keyboard shortcut which you want to associate with that button you can also use the combination of shift control and alt keys along with the pre-entered uh, keyboard shortcuts and then you just have to uh, click on that check button so these are the two buttons which are available so this is a minus button which is by default set at uh, undo which means you can undo the last action you can also change the hardness and softness and you can also reset the settings of the device so now i will show you the practical demonstration of the device on powerpoint so you just have to go to the draw tab and uh, you can see the movement of the mouse cursor when i move the pen on the device so we just have to move the pen and then the mouse cursor will move along in order to select anything you just have to tap the pen on the board and you can write anything for example i'm right for example now i'm writing introduction and i will convert it into a editable and modifiable text you can use the minus key to undo the last action now i'll use ink to text option and then select the written text using the lasso tool and then wait for a few seconds and that written text will be converted into a regular text which can be added which can be modified and which can be used anywhere in order to do the changes you just have to click on the select button which is on the left top corner so now i'm writing an equation which is a plus b square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab and i will convert it into a regular equation using the ink to math option you just have to select this equation using the lasso tool and then you have to wait for some few seconds so this equation is converted into a regular equation and you can edit modify or do the formatting of this equation so now i will write another equation which is cos square theta plus sine square theta is equal to 1 which is a trigonometric identity so i will convert it into regular equation using the ink to math option and that equation will be converted into a editable equation and you can use it in any document you can also convert or you can also write the greek letters for example theta and convert them into uh, into editable uh, symbols for example you can also write omega you can write any other Greek letter which you want to do for example psi phi alpha beta gamma you can convert any of these Greek letters into the editable and modifiable uh, modifiable text So now I'm writing a text and I will convert it into regular text and uh, we will see when it will, it will be converted whether it has some mistakes and how to rectify those mistakes. So I'm writing dear students we will have a class at 2 p.m. 
and now I will convert it into a regular text using ink tool. Text tool. Then you have to wait for a few seconds. Okay, so text is converted, but there are a few mistakes. So you have to go to the select tool and then click inside the box, text box, and rectify the mistakes by simple removing the mistakes and writing the new letters. You can also draw the shapes and convert it into a refined shape. For example, I'm drawing a circle. And now I will try to draw a triangle. You have to use ink to shape option for converting these shapes into regular shapes. It will say, take some time, maybe a few seconds, and then it will be converted. And you can move these shapes simply. You can you can move these shapes simply by going to the select tool and then moving that shape in any direction. You can also use the pen to select all the items and then delete them using the uh, fourth button, which we configure that is the delete button. You can also draw a polygon. This is a simple polygon, and uh, we will convert into a regular polygon, which can be modifiable, which can be rotated, and which can be moved to any space or any place. So now I will use that pen on a PowerPoint slideshow. You can use it in three different modes: laser pen and highlighter. So this is the laser pointer. This is the pen, and this is the highlighter. So now we will use the highlighter. You just have to tap on the screen and then move the pen, and the text will be highlighted. So the tip is you just have to place the pen on the board and then you you should see on the board while writing in this way you can write in the correct direction or in the correct orientation you can change the slides by tapping the pen on the board you can also change the slides by tapping the pen on the board so once again we will use the same features which are the laser pointer uh, when you press the plus button it will be treated as a right click. You can also select the highlighter button. So see, you can highlight any text very easily. You just have to look at the board while writing. So this is the pen tool and we will write something on the screen while presenting. For example, we will have a quiz. So you can write anything, you can, you can highlight anything. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.